It's so great to be in this space to talk. I, I'm just so grateful and humbled every time I walk in here with the huge team effort it took for us to get this project done and to have everybody able to come home to this space, see each other and connect and come to different ethnic and cultural celebrations and use this space in so many different ways, even all at the same time. So it has been a wonderful to be able to be here, to welcome you, and I'm so grateful that you're here to support us in the next campaign, and we are so excited about where Holland is positioned right now. We have this project done, but we are still working out the bugs and still you know, bringing in people from around the nation to entertain us and to fill downtown, because when you come to Highland for an event, you can come early and leave late, because there's so much beautiful um, entertainment and food and drink all the way down 8th Street, as well as being here, and then, of course, parking is free. So it is a great space to try to sell people to discover Highland through the Civic Center, and we're great, grateful to do that. And as you get on the second floor up there, you can look out and almost see water, <laughs> because we have a waterfront in Highland. A waterfront in Highland, and those are the words we want to connect now. We have waterfronthighland.org. We've been working on that for about a year and having the conversations, talking with stakeholders, opening it up to charrettes, public brainstorming sessions. We've been talking to the principals, and now starting this week, this coming week, we will be doing four days with designers, and the public can come as well to watch, and we'll be get, getting into actual ideas. There's already been about 2,800 ideas on what to do. People love water, and they love Holland, and they love building it even bigger and building that message for us. So there's been great participation. So we will have that this coming week, talking about not just the postage stamp of the James D. Young power plant property, which is pretty big. It's like three centennial parks, but that whole waterfront area from Lake Michigan all the way down the Black River as it connects to Howard. We wanna talk about that whole area. So we have township people involved and everybody we can think of involved to really get all kinds of ideas on the table. So even if those ideas don't land on that property, they can land someplace else because this is our opportunity to have a public discussion about it all. So please be involved and come on that next Thursday night when we they talk about all the ideas that came up. And then in May, there'll be another charrette where we talk about just the James Young property and what's possible there. So we'd love to have everybody be involved in that as well. And you can go to the web website, waterfronthighland.org, submit ideas, see what's been happening, and, and get involved. So that would be great. We also, in Highland, have a housing discussion. We have conversation um, about housing, and we want to develop more of it all through that spectrum. And so there are about three projects that I know of right now with people that have stepped up to say, you know what, Holland doesn't have to be a franchise. It's not gonna do housing like everybody else does. We have people that are willing to step forward and try to solve somebody else's problem. They don't just think about themselves. So whatever their background, they hear of an issue and they start talking to each other and they start bringing other people together and pretty soon that table is pretty full of people from all different places that say, yeah, you know, I can bring this and I can bring that and what if we went to this level? And it's so exciting to see what can be coming in the next couple years about housing and housing. And so please stay tuned on that and I so want to try to help navigate those conversations and continue those trusted relationships that we've been developing over the years so that people will be willing to come together and know that you're going to work together that you can trust each other that you're going to be a part of something that no one person can do on their own 